Want to become famous? Big fallas. You big Want to know how to get rid of these kinds of chat? In this video, I'm going to show you how AutoMod can assist you with that. Hey guys, before we get started, my name is Chase and I make streamer support videos. I also stream on twitch.tv slash chasebeyond. There you can feel free to ask me any questions you may have about streaming, or just stop by and see what's up. That's cool too. Okay, so you might be wondering, what is AutoMod and how can I use it? AutoMod is a Twitch moderation tool that automatically mods your chat. It essentially catches any inappropriate chat and holds it for review. From there, you or your moderation team can approve or deny any message caught by the auto mod. That way you can make sure that your chat stays as clean as you want it to be. Also, auto mod detects misspellings and evasive language. So it's actually pretty smart too. So why would we set up auto mod on our stream? Well, for one thing, it gives mods a break from common issue words or every time the big follows bot shows up to the stream or when somebody decides to say, Overall, it gives a great baseline chat filter so that your chat stays as positive as you require. Also, if you're new to streaming or you don't have a moderation team yet, auto mod serves really well until you get those extra guys on deck. All right, so let's get in there and show you how to access the auto mod tools. So we're gonna start on the main Twitch page and then we're gonna click on our profile picture in the upper right. You're gonna go down to creator dashboard, click on that. Then up here in the menu, you're going to go and click on settings. From there, you're going to click on moderation. And then you will see the auto mod controls here. And then the three clickable sections under auto mod controls. That's all of your auto mod controls. Okay. So we're going to start with this first one, auto mod rule sets. Click on that. And what you'll be given is a slider. And under this slider, you have different types of auto mod filtering. So aggression, bullying, disability, sexuality, misogyny, race, religion, uh, swearing, sex-based terms. Those things are what you're going to be filtering with each of these, um, with the sliders in these boxes here. But to make it easy, you can use this slider. Level zero on the left, all the way left is auto mod is off. None of this stuff will be filtered out. So be aware of that. Um, you can go to level one, a little bit of moderation. Level two is some moderation. Level three is more. Level four is a lot of moderation that will filter tons of stuff. I actually recommend not doing that much, but it's your own stream. So it is your choice. Now you can go into uh, you can set a uh, one of these settings here and then you can go into them individually and do more or less filtering for whatever you're looking for in your chat dynamic. So let's say aggression, we want more filtering. Okay, bullying, we'll say maximum filtering on bullying or you know, no filtering, disability, however you want it to be is how you can make it. So it's completely customizable according to your needs. Also, one thing to keep in mind, AutoMod doesn't ban timeout um, or mute any users that have said a word that is being filtered by the AutoMod. Now, what it will do instead is it will open up a box that will let you or your mod team approve or deny anything that has not made it through the filter, but it won't make any initial consequences towards that user. Okay, so if you click on the second auto mod tool, the block terms and phrases, this is what you'll see. Essentially, you'll see a box where you can put in any word you want. That word will be blocked from your stream and will not appear. So if you have private information like where you live or something that you don't want anybody else to know, you can put it in block terms and phrases. Now, Anything that you have listed as privacy public, that will be viewable by your moderators. Now you can set it to privacy private and that will not be viewable to your moderators. 
That way you don't accidentally dox yourself. And you can actually also put in emotes. So if you don't want a certain emote showing up on your stream, you can type in, say, Carl Smile. And then add, and that emote will not show up on your stream. Now you can also put in a word phrase with spaces in between each word, such as, go away. Now, anytime someone says, go away, or away go, whatever order those words are in, they will be cancel out. Now, it won't cancel out the word go by itself, or away by itself. But if those two words are next to each other, the automod will not let it happen. Also, one more awesome thing you could do with this is that you can type in, say, big follows or want to become famous. Like you see those bots that come into your stream every now and then and try to spam or, or hack you or whatever they try to do. Now, if you type those in blocked words and phrases, you will never deal with those guys again. There won't be a problem because they can't type in their thing. So their entire message gets blocked. So be sure to put in those common spam bot phrases in your block terms and phrases whenever you come across a spam bot like that, and then you won't have an issue again. Okay, so the last menu of the automod is permitted terms and phrases. It's very similar to the block terms and phrases. However, instead of blocking words, it allows them to pass through the automod filter. Say you have a high filter on profanity but there's a certain profanity word that you want to slip through the filter and allow on your stream. Well, you can type that word in, in this box here, and it will appear in this menu as a word that is approved. Now, if you have a word that gets filtered a lot through AutoMod, and every time that it shows up, you or your mods approve that word, the more often that you approve that word, it will eventually show up onto the permitted terms and phrases uh, because apparently according to you and your mods it is okay to use on your stream so the auto mod learns that and says okay this word can pass through i'm going to put it in the permitted terms and phrases list and that's it that's all the options for auto mod so with auto mod you can establish your own chat language filter and establish around the clock chat moderation and so in this way, you can create a better and more positive chat experience in your community. Anyways, hope you enjoyed this video. Hopefully you got everything that you wanted from it. Feel free to hit that like button, hit that subscribe, and tick that bell, and you'll know when I post my next video. And of course, have a wonderful day, and I will catch you on the next one. We harpoon the ground, or... Oh, fu oh fudge! Oh, never mind. We're, uh... We're, uh, yeah, it's, uh... Oh, my oh snap! My, my... <laughs> Yikes! Uh, oh shoot! Oh, okay. Now we're oh shoot! Oh, uh, we're we're on the dock. We're on the dock. Okay. Oh my God, we're sinking fast. No, 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 no. We ain't sinking. Oh, take the water. Get the water. Oh, what is happening? <laughs> oh, we got out. Oh my goodness! Uh, it's a miracle. God is on our side. <laughs>